blissful greetings, everyone. Blissful greetings. It's so good to see you again, to see you all again. Thank you for viewing this video. I'm doing something I normally don't do, but I'm following a trend right now. I've been watching YouTube videos, and that's a surprise. <laughs> and um, there's, <clears throat> it just got me hooked, so I had to try it for myself. So, you've read the title already. Platinum Bliss ASMR went shopping for the cheapest thing on T and Co. Yes, Tiffany and Company. But before we start, I want to share another snack I came across. And anytime I find something new, I want to share it with you all. I feel like, you know, I want to please the viewers, so. <laughs> This is for those who are into sweets, specifically peanut butter and chocolate. So this is the Reese's Snack Cake. Three hundred eighty calories per serving. So, oh, oh, and one one whole package is a serving. So. I thought it was going to be 760. That's a full meal. Just about. But anyway, it's Reese's Snack Cakes. So who knew? Looks like a brownie on the bottom and then the regular peanut butter filling. Of course, coated in chocolate. So this looks really good. Give you feedback on a later video if I think of it. Remind me in the comments if I don't. The Reese's Big Cup with the pretzels inside was pretty good. If I have to be honest though, it's not as good as the original. A lot of times the classics are the best. So we'll, we'll see how this fares out, but uh, I didn't prefer the pretzel to the regular Reese's cup filling. Um, the Snickers Valentine. <laughs> Valentine uh, candy bar. It tasted just like a Snickers. It was smaller and in the shape of a heart. So, happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> so if you have to have a sweet and you don't want as, much cal as many calories as a regular or king size Snickers, go for the Valentine heart snickers. Okay, on to today's video. In this video, I bought the cheapest thing that I could find online at Tiffany and Company. Yes, you know I love my sparkle, <laughs> but I don't shop at Tiffany. I mean, I know there's other trends like Hermes bags and Cartier, the cheapest thing there. This is not going to be a trend. I'm continuing and repeating over and over, but I just thought for once it would be fun. Plus, it wasn't that much. So let's go through what I researched. I don't have the equipment to show you as I researched and everything. I know there's a um, YouTuber in Canada who bought the very same item that I did for $30, and I got it for $20. It's pretty good. Cheapest thing at Tiffany.com is $20. Um, there was a YouTuber in Australia who said that she found the cheapest item on her Tiffany.com site as a $40 wine glass. Very beautiful, very thin, because it's crystal. It's real crystal, lead crystal. So it had a very thin stem and it was engraved beautifully with the etched glass Tiffany & Co. But I found something cheaper than $40, so, and I didn't want a wine glass, so thank goodness. Okay, so I first looked at jewelry. Okay, sterling silver, of course. The first item 
of rings is like 180 160 dollars that's a ring a basic silver no stones there was one really cute one it was a band and it had the antique 1837 or whenever tiffany and co um started and it had you know it was like an in a concave band very cute it'd be a nice wedding band for a couple to get but too much so i went to the tableware and barware yes they sell plates and dishes and um shot glasses and things and a shot glass was 35 dollars. it was very cute but i don't need a shot glass doesn't matter if it was the cheapest thing i would have bought it to show you and maybe filled it with beads or crystals or something to make it pretty for a decoration but um because i don't use shot glasses that much not really not really ever but um <laughs> Besides the point, there was um, desk accessories, and they had some really nice uh, T and Co. desk accessories. The cheapest was thirty-five dollars. It was a desk calendar, a tiny no, not desk calendar, pocket calendar. They were like three or four inches by two inches. They were leatherette or leather, and they had one was Tiffany blue color, and one was the straight black black color. Of leather pocket calendar very nice $35 I thought well well I don't really need a pocket calendar but again this is not for things I need it's just to, for fun follow the trend and find the cheapest thing then I went to jewelry um, well I went back to jewelry <laughs> and um, there was an item that wasn't really jewelry itself but um, a finding more than more of a finding and it was a link. It was a clasp. One link. It was about that big, I think. And you can open it. It's spring, it's spring, uh, spring clasp. It's, yeah, it's got a, well, you'll see. You'll see if it's what I'm thinking of. Because um, I know they have a charm bracelet that every link has these openings that you can add a charm on. Every link is what I think. And I'm hoping it's one of those links. And so the one in Canada, she bought it for $30 and I bought it for 20, 2168, I think with tax. And I was surprised she got it so soon. I, I got mine in about five or six days. I, I picked it up last night out of my mailbox. It was, oh, we have one of those Amazon hubs, lockers. It was in there waiting for me. I mean, UPS second day air. That's amazing. I mean, I didn't expect it to be back, to be here so soon, five to six days. So that's good. Here's the package. <laughs> nice little package, very secure. So, I mean, I was amazed at when she, the one in Canada opened hers, it had professional packaging and a ribbon and a box, just like a thousand dollar piece might have. I just think it's amazing the way Tiffany handles every item as it's as if it's fragile I mean precious very precious and all worth the same thing I guess that's what high prestigious um, high prestige prestigious prestigious companies do but anyway let's just get right into it <laughs> got my trusty scissors Fiskars and I'm gonna cut the tape one pound it's not even that but you can see it came from, let me see, I don't know if it'll focus, but it says Tico. <laughs> okay, I can't see. But anyway, okay, I'm going to cut the other side. And, okay, now I haven't done anything with this yet, so... side to cut so there we go <laughs> it's exciting Ooh, flips right open and oh the whole thing opens up and there is the box Tiffany and company and there look at that look how they packaged it isn't that beautiful sticker 
says Tiffany and Company, New York. That is so nice. Let's try to be careful with it. And you open it. And la la la. Look what's inside. Isn't that beautiful? Ah, I'm amazed. So I've got I got this Tiffany. Here, let me show you. Amazing. You have okay, this gift bag. Isn't that amazing? Here. This gift bag. I got a, a Tiffany Company gift bag. <laughs> and um, so I'll definitely be giving this to someone with something that's not Tiffany in it. Maybe. Well, or maybe for a special occasion, maybe retirement gift or birthday or a baby shower or something. Um, and then you get all this tissue paper. So I'll be using that in that little gift bag. Oh, <laughs> and then of course they have the receipt. A whopping 21.68. But um, just the experience of opening it is worth the $20. <laughs> I forgot about this. I sent myself a gift card. <laughs> I know. Hey, it's, it, was, it was free. So, why not? So, you take it out. It has the little embossing. I don't know if you can pick that up in the light, but it says Tiffany and Co. <laughs> I'm so sorry. It's just, it says, I love myself. Platinum Bliss ASMR. <laughs> I don't know if you can pick that up or not. I'm sorry. I'm sorry if you can't. But it says, I love myself. Platinum Bliss ASMR. Put that on my bulletin board right there. Okay, so now for the unwrapping. And the actual item itself. This is kind of exciting. Christmas all over again. I'll keep the ribbon. So pretty. Yay. <laughs> box and I did order it from the actual online online set online site itself because because I believe to follow the trend it had to be the actual site itself not the um, eBay or something like that but wow look at the little bag <laughs> Tiffany and Co and you get a little Another gift tag. It says, the care of the sterling silver. Okay. Sorry, it's not focusing very well today. That's my camera for you. My phone. And, to be careful because it's very small. And there it is. I would just smell the bags. I don't know why I do that. What am I expecting to smell? A Tiffany store? What does a Tiffany store smell like? But anyway, here's the tissue paper and the little clasp inside you can see. There it is, I'm so excited. Oh, guys, wait till you see this. So amazing. Oh my gosh. Okay, 
this is the, here's the clincher. It has, it has Tiffany and company engraved on it right there. Okay. You're not going to be able to see it, but take my word for it. It's engraved right there. It says T and company, Tiffany and company. And then I don't know if you can tell, but at the top here, it, opens and closes right there like that and the hinge is right here so a nice sterling silver link or clasp they call it shiny silver too and I hear that their things do tarnish they don't cover it with rhodium or anything so um, that's fine and in the future, when I use this on a piece of uh, jewelry or a necklace or bracelet or earring, <laughs> who knows, um, I will show it to you. I'll feature it in an upcoming video if I find a, a use for it. Um, or it may just sit in my jewelry box. No, but it's, um, and I think these might be sterling silver tarnish proof bags. They have some kind of coating. I'm not sure about that, but it's got a double sided. It's got two pockets in, in the bag, in a little tote bag. So I could keep something on the other side. But yes, I have um, a couple chains, nice necklaces, but the clasps broke off. So this way I can attach one end of the chain to the other chain. And I got myself a Tiffany & Co necklace. If it has, it has a signature on it, the engraving, and it has a real link from Tiffany & Co. So, there you go. Here it goes, it's in the bag. <laughs> I am going to do that. I'll call it, I'll call it my Tiffany necklace. Even though most of it will not be from Tiffany, but one part of it is. But anyway, there you have it. I'm going to put this back in the box and, um, yeah. Thank you for viewing this video today. It was fun having you along while I opened the cheapest item I found on Tiffany & Co. website. Take care. I hope you all are doing well out there. And, um, We'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.